Alexei Leonidovich Pajidnov is a Russian-American video game designer and computer engineer. He is best known for developing Tetris in 1984 while working for the Dorodnitsyn Computing Center of the Soviet Academy of Sciences, a Soviet government-founded R&D center. He only started to get royalties from his creation in 1996 when he and Hank Rogers formed the Tetris Company. Pajidnov was born to parents who were both writers, his father was a critic of the arts, and his mother was a journalist who wrote for both newspapers and a film magazine. It was through his parents that Pajitnov gained exposure to the arts, eventually developing a passion for cinema. He accompanied his mother to many film screenings, including the Moscow Film Festival. Pajitnov was also mathematically inclined, enjoying puzzles and problem solving. In 1967, when he was 11 years old, Pajitnov's parents divorced. For several years, he lived with his mother in a one-bedroom apartment owned by the state. The two were eventually able to move into a private apartment at 49 Gersten Street, when Pajitnov was 17. He later went on to study applied mathematics at the Moscow Aviation Institute. In 1977, Pajitnov worked as a summer intern at the Soviet Academy of Sciences. Once he graduated in 1979, he accepted a job there working on speech recognition at the Academy's Dorodnitsyn Computing Center. When the Computing Center received new equipment, its researchers would write a small program for it in order to test its computing capabilities. According to Pajignov, this became, his, excuse for making games. Computer games were fascinating to him because they offered a way to bridge the gap between logic and emotion, and Pajignov held interests in both mathematics and puzzles, as well as the psychology of computing. Searching for inspiration, Pajignov recalled his childhood memories of playing pentominoes, a game where you create pictures using its shapes. Remembering the difficulty he had in putting the pieces back into their box, Pajitnov felt inspired to create a game based on that concept. Using an Electronica 60 in the computing center, he began working on what would become the first version of Tetris. Building the first prototype in two weeks, Pajitnov spent longer playtesting and adding to the game, finally completing it on June 6, 1984. This primitive version did not have levels nor a scoring system, but Pajitnov knew he had a potentially great game, since he couldn't stop playing it at work. The game attracted the interest of co-workers like fellow programmer Dmitry Pavlovsky, who helped Pajitnov connect with Vadim Gerasimov, a 16-year-old intern at the Soviet Academy. Pajitnov wanted to make a color version of Tetris for the IBM personal computer, and enlisted the intern to help. Gerasimov created the PC version in less than three weeks, and with contributions from Pavlovsky, spent an additional month adding new features like scorekeeping and sound effects. The game, first available in the Soviet Union, appeared in the West in 1986. Pajitnov also created a sequel to Tetris, entitled Weltris, which has the same principle, but in a three-dimensional environment where the player sees the playing area from above. Tetris was licensed and managed by Soviet company Alorg, which had a monopoly on the import and export of computer hardware and software in the Soviet Union, and advertised with the slogan from Russia with love. Because he was employed by the Soviet government, Pajitnov did not receive royalties. Pajitnov, together with Vladimir Pokilko, moved to the United States in 1991 and later, in 1996, founded the Tetris Company with Hank Rogers, which finally allowed him to collect royalties from his game. He helped design the puzzles and the Super NES versions of Yoshi's Cookie and design the game Pandora's Box, which incorporates more traditional jigsaw-style puzzles. Pajitnov and Pokilko founded the 3D software technology company Enimatech, which developed the game, Screensaver Elfish. He was employed by Microsoft from October 1996 until 2005. While there, he worked on the Microsoft Entertainment Pack, the Puzzle Collection, MSN Mind Aerobics and MSN Games Groups. Pajitnov's new, enhanced version of Hexic, Hexic HD, was included with every new Xbox 360 Premium package. On August 18, 2005, Wild Snake Software announced that Pajitnov would be collaborating with them to release a new line of puzzle games. Pajitnov has a wife, Nina, and two sons named Peter and Dmitri. Dmitri died in a skiing accident on Mount Rainier in 2017. In 1996, GameSpot named him as the fourth most influential computer game developer of all time. On March 7, 2007, he received the Game Developer's Choice Award's first Penguin Award. The award was given for pioneering the casual games market. On June 24, 2009, he received the honorary award at the Lara, Der Deutsche Games Award in Cologne, Germany. In 2012, 
IGN included Pajidnov on their list of five memorable video game industry one, hit wonders, calling him the ultimate video game one hit wonder. On 2015, Pajitnov won the Biskaya Award at the Fun and Serious Game Festival. Thanks for watching.